In 1968, employees of a Japanese bank were transporting 300 million yen worth of factory worker bonuses when they were suddenly pulled over by a police officer. The officer told them that someone had just blown up the bank manager's house and that their car was likely wired with explosives as well. Horrified, the four employees quickly got out as the officer crawled under their car to inspect for bombs. But all of a sudden, he began shouting the whole thing was about to blow. And when the employees saw heavy smoke and flames coming from beneath the vehicle, they ran for their lives. But when there was no explosion, they quickly became suspicious. Upon returning, they were shocked to realize that their car and the officer were gone. In their place remained a single used flare. And turns out the officer had lied about everything and made off with the money. The reason the employees believed the officer's lies so quickly was because their bank actually did receive bomb threats in the days prior. These threats, however, were fake and likely sent by the thief himself. Switching cars three times and leaving behind misleading evidence at each spot, the man further confused the authorities. And despite a 900 million yen investigation, the single man responsible was never caught.